By now, you've probably seen this picture of Governor Brewer wagging her finger at the president. This image thrust Arizona into the national spotlight. And now here we go again. This is the picture making headlines tonight. Look closely at the T-shirt in the middle. That is President Obama's face, and it looks like these guys used it for target practice. Tonight, the Secret Service is investigating, and Peoria police are investigating one of their own. Our Lindsay Reiser is live tonight. Lindsay? Well, seen in Catherine, the picture was actually posted on Facebook about a week ago, but it wasn't until today, one day after that infamous finger pointing photo went viral, that someone cried foul and the photo was removed. We received information about a possible po policy violation today involving one of our employees. The investigation stems around this picture posted on the Facebook account of Peoria Police Sergeant Patrick Shearer. It shows several young men in the desert carrying guns and holding up a T-shirt with President Obama's likeness on it that appears ridden with bullet holes. We were contacted by the Secret Service. The Secret Service confirms they've launched an investigation surrounding the photo, which was posted on the 19th, but was taken down Thursday. Peoria police say Sergeant Shearer has been with the department at least 14 years, and now is a patrol sergeant with the Northern Precinct. We have a social media policy that addresses employee conduct with respect to the use of social media. While Davies says Shearer will remain on duty, Peoria police are conducting their own investigation to determine if he violated their social media policy. The policy says, quote, posting information regarding off-duty activity that may tend to bring an officer's reputation into question is strongly discouraged. We uh, seek to maintain a positive image and, and ensure that, that we're always... Uh, uh, holding our employees to, to that standard. And we tried to contact Sergeant Shearer tonight by calling him and visiting his home, but we've been unable to contact him so far. We also asked for his disciplinary history and list of commendations, but so far that has not been available to us. We will stay on it, though. For now, reporting live in Peoria, Lindsay Reiser, CBS 5 News. Lindsay, thank you. The